In this video, we're going to look at factorising where there is both a common factor and a difference of two squares. Whenever you're factorising, always look for a common factor first. So, for instance, in this first example, 2 is a common factor that leaves me with f squared minus e squared, which is in the form of a difference of two squares. So this will leave me with 2 f plus e, f minus e. OK, next one, 27 minus 3y squared. The common factor here is 3, and that leaves me with 9 minus y squared. And then again, I've got a difference of two squares inside the bracket, so that's 3 minus y, 3 plus y. Lastly, my common factor here, well, I can definitely take a 5 out, but I've got an r cubed and an r term, so I can take an r out as well. So I've got 5r... I can take out, and I'm left with 4r squared minus 1, which is, again, a difference of two squares. So I've got four, 5r outside, 4r squared, well, that square rooted is 2r, uh, 1 square rooted is 1, so I've got 2r minus 1, 2r plus 1. And so the fully factorised form for that one is 5r, 2r minus 1, 2r plus 1. 